Chronological age is the measured amount of time since birth. This type of age has little place in the assessment of maturational status of an individual. It is not a good indicator of a person's growth status. Dental age is usually assessed with three characteristics. First, based on which teeth have erupted, amount of root resorption of primary teeth, and amount of permanent teeth development. At birth, based on the radiographic findings, the mandibular central incisors and lateral incisors show calcification about half of the crown. Cusps of canine and deciduous molars are seen. At two years, majority of children have 20 teeth clinically present. By two and a half years of age, deciduous dentition is usually complete. At six years, which is the stage of eruption of permanent teeth, the common sequence of eruption is mandibular central incisors, mandibular first molar, and maxillary first molars. At seven years, maxillary central incisors and mandibular lateral incisors erupt. At eight years, maxillary lateral incisors erupt. After eight years, there is no further eruption of any teeth for the next two to three years. At 11 years, group of teeth erupts simultaneously, starting with mandibular canines, mandibular first premolars, and maxillary first premolars. At 12 years, mandibular second premolars, maxillary second premolars, and maxillary canines are seen erupting. Later maxillary and mandibular second molars also erupt. Dental age usually correlates with chronological age, but the correlation is weak. Sequence of eruption and timing of eruption are genetically determined. Teeth eruption is advanced in girls than boys. Calcification of mandibular canine coincides with puberty. Assessing the skeletal maturity status of an individual helps in knowing whether he or she will grow appreciably in the treatment period. This has important implications in the treatment planning and response to treatment. The position of the patient in the facial growth curve is important while planning orthopedic therapy, functional appliance therapy and orthognathic surgery. The orthopedic or functional appliance treatment during the periods of accelerated growth can contribute significantly to correction of dentofacial deviations leading to an improvement in the facial appearance. The physical maturity of an individual is not related to chronological age. Physical maturity can be assessed by the skeletal maturity or skeletal age. The bones mature at different rate and follow a reasonable sequence in doing so. Hence, the developmental status of a child can be estimated by determination of degree of completion of facial skeleton, 